this run out. Okay. And forget it. We're recording. <laughs> no, we're not really recording. The camera's we're recording. We're playing. We're playing we're podcasting play. 101. Okay, let me uh, get a level since something's changed. Oh, as in I say something? I probably should say something. <laughs> it would be helpful. Hello, this is Kathleen Burns Kingsbury, a wealth psychology expert and author. It would be good if I could tell. I am here today with Breaking Money Silence, a segment that's aimed at empowering you to talk more openly and honestly about finances with your loved ones. Roger doesn't believe you should plan for your pets because he's a farmer. However, I think we should plan for our kitties. I'm only focused on doggies and kitties today. No cows? Chickens? No cows, but that seems like a more complicated estate planning issue, actually. Uh, Out of my area of expertise. Well, the documentary that's coming in is about um, farmers. Oh, really? Yeah, it's really funny. <laughs> I would, it's Yellow House Films. Uh, do a little read there. I'll get a level. Hello, this is Kathleen Burns Kingsbury, a wealth psychology expert and author. I'm here today with Breaking Money Silence, a segment aimed at empowering you to talk more openly and honestly about personal finance with your loved ones. This week, I want to discuss estate planning for your pets and why it's important to have money conversations about who will take care of your furry friend if you become ill or die. feel more soft-spoken today than I usually am. I think it's because I haven't had 20 cups of coffee. Yeah. Would you, would you like a cup of coffee? <laughs> no. I you, hear th I hear there's no water, so I'm going to I just minimize made, my intake. Oh, I just made some. Do we mind if I just run? Oh, no. Cup? Did you make enough for two or just one? Yes, yeah, no, two. Oh, I'll have some. You want some? I'm now going to change my mind. Okay. Now uh, We're going to go get coffee. 